Hi everybody and welcome to Travelling with Russell and welcome to Moscow and welcome to a new video and welcome to a video kind of by request. Now I had a few people send me messages, Russell there's a new metro line open, Russell there's the longest escalator in Moscow open and you've got to go and ride it and let us know what you think. So I'm here today to show you what the longest escalator in Moscow is like. Now the weather of course is beautiful today. It was expected to snow pretty much all afternoon and evening tonight. So this is Mariano Rocha station. Now, please excuse me if I've got the name wrong. I've tried to get this right for about the last two hours. Now this is the big circle line. Now this opened literally four days ago and this station is completely brand new. Now, how cool is this station by the way, with these lights and these kind of ball bearings or balls holding up the station. It's uh, kind of a bit of a feat. I wonder uh, how it's possibly doing that. Now, the whole reason for these couple of circles here, this is now a closed uh, loop. It was originally only three stations back in 1969. And finally, a few days ago, the mayor, mayor of Moscow opened the longest circular metro line in the whole world and it's 70 kilometers there's 31 stations now we're just going to go see one of course but as the snow is absolutely coming down now um, the uh, escalator is right inside so let's get in there and warm up a little now i think i might as well just do a brief a kind of tour of the uh, station as we come in this is a big heater blowing nice warm air in here as well so as you walk in it's very nice and warm compared to outside. Let's just go past these guys and we'll keep the video going. Now the lobby of this station is very big by the way. I'm not sure uh, are they expecting big population growth of this station or this district. Of course it's only a few days into the opening so maybe uh, people haven't fully discovered it yet. Ticket booths over there. Pretty much everything is automated here. You will uh, use your card now. For the first five days, the local administration and the Moscow mayor decided to get everybody free transport on the big circle line. So we can just literally walk in and use the big circle line and then connect to another line for free for five days. How nice is the government to do that? Now I've got my phone out here with the stopwatch so we can see how long the longest escalator in Moscow is. Now, the previous longest escalator was 127 meters. Now this is 130 meters, three meters longer. Now, I wonder if there's a time difference. I don't think it would be that much, but let's step on, let's press start, and let's go for it. Now, there's a kind of an interesting thing here on the side. We can actually see how many meters we've gone. So we've already gone five meters. Now we know it's 130 meters. Now we're gonna get the whole of the escalator right in one video here. So if you wanna see the end, just fast forward. But I'm pretty sure you're watching this only to see the longest escalator in Moscow. Now the longest one in Russia is actually in St. Petersburg. And it's just a few meters longer than this. Now why couldn't they make this a few meters longer? And there's some signage over here. Just letting you know again how uh, long it is. What are we up to? 35 meters. And we're just passing 50 seconds. Lots of these nice interesting lights here. They're kind of circles, I guess, for the big circle line. What do you think? Do you reckon that's the whole meaning behind it? The circle line and the big circles? I wonder, as I'm trying to fill this time here as we head down the escalator one minute in and we're 55 meters it's like we're going uh, scuba diving and we're going under the depths of the Moscow River even people want to walk down I imagine if you uh, are starting to uh, use this for the first time and you live here you know you kind of just now realize in your head that how many minutes every day you're gonna have to uh, use there's some uh, interesting uh, fun facts about the metro here as well on these stickers. 75 meters. 
a minute 48. Yeah, so 70 kilometers, 31 stations is what makes up this uh, big circle line. It's, uh, there's actually now two circle lines that are considered metro, so underground lines. Uh, that's the whole kind of important part about this. 31 stations. Now they opened the last nine stations a few days ago to completely close the loop. It was sort of built over time. It started out with only three stations in 1969. Imagine they've managed to sort of uh, circumnavigate the whole of the Moscow, Moscow region and finally close the loop. And the mayor was here, all the uh, employees were here, their families. It was a big deal. As we're coming up to two, uh, just over two and a half meet, uh, minutes, 115 meters we've just passed. And we're coming to the bottom. Let's see what it's gonna be. I'm pretty sure we're gonna tick right on three minutes. And we're gonna surpass it. 125 meters. All right, and let's go right past 130. Look at that, three minutes and three seconds to go 130 meters underground. So as I come down to the station level here of Mariana Rocha, I really hope you've enjoyed this video. It's probably the shortest one on the channel so far, even though it was the longest escalator ride. I really found this kind of fun to do this video. Uh, and this is actually part of another video, so you might have either watched that now, or you can watch it afterwards, where I go and visit all nine new stations here on the Big Circle Line. So you can check that out. Actually, that'll be the next video if you watch right after this one. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like escalator rides, give it a thumbs down if you like. Imagine living here, well, in this district, and three minutes every day up, three minutes every day down, six minutes of your day riding an escalator. How would you be? Is that something that you could handle and deal with? Let me know in the comments, please. Yeah, thanks everybody. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I'm gonna go get something to eat, I'm hungry. I've been doing all the video continuously for the whole day, so thanks. Check out that next video on the channel and I'll see everybody soon, bye.